you're an A&R director at Atlantic Records. Um, my question for you, for a new independent artist who has a few songs, let's say they have a good catalog of songs, um, what is some advice you can give them on to how, as to how they should decide which song they should really get behind and start promoting? Um, I mean, I always do the, the well, one, you got to go with, with what you feel in your heart. You know what I'm saying? You feel, well, that's what you start with, the song that you feel like most represents you and the message you're trying to bring and all of that, right? Mm -hmm. Um and then you got to do the ear test with your with the people that you know around you. You know what I'm saying? That's I do. You know, I have if you got the manager, friends, family, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You got to play the records for them. You know what I'm saying? See which is you just play them. You just see which ones they naturally gravitate. You don't tell them nothing. You just play them ten records. You know what I'm saying? Whatever, and you see which ones they gravitate towards most. And then you take some of your friends from your neighborhood or whatever. You get some girls come through or whatever, whatever. And you just play them the records and you see which ones they naturally vibe to which ones they naturally start moving to or dancing to or which ones they naturally give you the most feedback on and stuff like that um and then you make a decision based off of that you know what i'm saying okay i'll drop this record and then after that i'll drop this record but now you have something to go off of you know what i'm saying other than just what you think you know what i mean because you're not just making the music for you you're making it for people you want people to like it so it's important to have people hear it to give you good feedback or and like i said you don't even have to you just have to see it. When people hear songs, they're going to naturally start to dance or move or get up or they're going to make certain faces or just things like that. You just have to be able to read the room and see what they gravitate towards. 